Okay, welcome fellow songwriter. Today is Friday the 23rd of uh, August 2013. Now, today's <clears throat> Songwriters Daily is going to be about, uh, yes, rhyming, but I, I've previously done a show on rhyming and I broke rhyming down to three ways that you rhyme, three different ways to rhyme. That's, as far as I'm concerned, that's what you break it down to because in certain books and teachers really seem to complicate it and you kind of think, wow, I don't even understand what that means. So I really urge you to have a look at that previous video. It's a fair way back. Anyway, but today on the rhyming, I want to speak about uh, one, just one factor of, of uh, the subject called rhyming in songwriting. And that simply is <clears throat> that it's not always what we want as songwriters to get a per what they call a perfect rhyme. <clears throat> so don't worry about the name of it, but just a rhyme that is just exact, uh, like run, fun, right? You can use perfect rhymes, as absolutely, but somehow these days it's almost more beneficial for you as a songwriter to not quite have it perfectly rhyming because it's it's slightly considered a little bit uh well i i can't i don't want to i don't want to state exactly what it's considered but i think it's something like a little bit more sophisticated or a little bit more craft or a little bit more skilled skillful to to not just have to have it so run, fun, you know, undone. Uh, it, instead to, uh, to, to, to have it close, but not really. So what the way I often do it is what they call assonance, assonance rhyming, but forget the word assonance right now, it doesn't matter. It's not about what it's called, it's about the way you use it. And assonance simply means like um, in one of my songs I'm writing right now, it uh, has moving at the end of moving, rhyming with blue. Now that's not strictly a rhyme, you know, a perfect rhyme I mean, it's an assonance rhyme because the moo uh, uh, in moving, the uh, in moving rhymes with the blue, <coughs> blue, uh, in the word blue. <coughs> Even though there's the ing, moving, it has still has a part rhyme in there. So you got the moving and blue. Okay? And that's what's really good to do in songwriting. Now rappers do it all the time and they even change the sounds of words to make them rhyme, which I love. I love how they do that. They're very, very talented. I love rappers for that. Uh, so anyway that's it for the show okay you don't have to have perfect rhymes so don't let it stress you out trying to think of a lyric that rhymes perfectly with the line that you're trying to rhyme to don't do that don't let that bother you if you have one a perfect rhyme that's okay if you don't don't worry about it you can find one that's something like it that has a sound in there something like it and that'll work perfect too okay good luck with your songwriting Really make your own luck by working hard every day, turning up as often as possible. <clears throat> I say every day, but you know what I mean. If it's if you don't get there today, don't stress out, but try to make it every day. Turn up for work, because your work is like my work. We're songwriters. We write songs for the world, for the people of the world, and certain people are going to love our, going to love our songs, and that's our job. We're writers. We're songwriters. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's lovely. So, thank you for watching. I can't wait to be back on Monday. Be in touch with me. Let's uh, talk and uh, keep building each other up. Okay, all the best. <clears throat> Big blessings. See you next week.